Welcome back to another action figure review. In this review, we're going to continue our look at the Bandai Dragon Ball Z Shudo action figures. Unfortunately, I don't have the packaging because he's been out for a few years, but these figures are definitely worth a review. Um, if you guys are actually looking for these figures, I will show you what a package look image is so you guys can um, have the resources you need to um, locate these figures if you want to track them down. That's what the packaging looks like. So, so we'll go ahead and uh, take a look at this very awesome Majin Buu figure. This action figure looks like he just jumped out of the uh, cartoon into a plastic mold. Looks fantastic. A very nice pink shade. It looks just like you know, the cartoon. He has black eyes, white teeth. He has his black belt with his gold buckle with the M etched into it. We have these very light gray pants. We have black and gold trim um, wristbands. We have black and gold shin, band, shin bands, guards, whatever you want to call them. And then we have, you know, a, his foot shoe is type of a like a mustard color. This figure is very nice. The sculpting is pretty incredible. He has his tail on his head, I guess. We have the blow holes throughout the figure. We have him on his head, here on his chest, on his arms, on his back there. And he does have muscle definition for the, from the sculpting. Very nice sculpt work. The materials feel great. Um, they feel like the high quality plastic. Like, I mean, my opinion, protruding hacks have the best plastic. And that's very, very similar to Boss Fight Studios' materials. These figures have a very unique design and a very unique articulation. Because you have articulation here at the head, he can look up, he can look down. It's taking it side to side and it will rotate 360 if you want it to. And then he has articulation here at the neck. You can look down farther, look up pretty far. Very nicely done. The shoulders are on a ball joint, they do rotate 360. If you notice here, this is a unique design to where it's kind of on a pig that sticks out a little farther than you would be used to. That's because they want you to be able to get a maximum of posability for your Dragon Ball figures to try to recreate some of the poses from the cartoon. But you know, the ball seats back inside there once you get it um, in position where you want it. There is articulation here to bicep, it does rotate. Does have bendable elbows on both arms. Get you 90 degrees, made a little better. They do go out. They do go up. Very cool. I kind of like this hand on him because you can get to get his. He has a thumb here, and you can like. Make it look like you know, he's rubbing his thumb across his neck, like he's saying like you're finished. You know, to like Goku or whoever he's fighting. Very nice. He does have a waist hole. You know, it goes 360. He doesn't sit very well, unfortunately, because of his sculpt design of his pants. But it's the best you're gonna get there. But it's the price you pay is either articulation or sculpted. You know, the aesthetics of the figure. It does have a very unique knee design. I did, they can get a 90 degrees. Um, these are made to where, you know, there's no joint in the knee. The one half of the leg is molded to this piece and the other piece comes up and is put on over the pins. So that way you don't have to worry about any breakage from joints. His feet do rotate 360. They do go down. Um, they do uh, pivot side 
the side for some very dramatic kicks. Very cool. He can do a pretty good split. Can even do a better split this way. Very nice figure. Awesome. Highly recommend these. Um, these used to retail between 17 and 20 bucks, depending on the retailer. But now they're kind of skyrocketing on the third market, such as eBay or Amazon. This figure only came with two accessories. I'm sorry, four accessories because there's four hands. Basically, this is extra sets of hands here. We have a thumbs up. We have another open hand here. The nails are painted on the hands. And we have one more set of hands here. These, I'm not sure what these are. Maybe he's snapping his fingers. I'm not sure. But he has his thumb connected to one of his fingers. So, different type of hands, different types of positions. Very nice quality um, figure. I doubt he doubted uh, anybody would turn these down to add them to your collection. Here he has, he compares with Goku. He looks very awesome. Very cool. I hope uh, they would make some more of these. Um, there is some more, but I don't have, but they're more of like a different uh, power ups, like your different hair colors of some of the characters, like Super Saiyan or God Mode. Well, if you guys enjoyed this look at this Majin Buu figure, he is very awesome. Highly recommending. If you like this video, please consider subscribing. That way you get notifications when I finish up of the figures that I have. And many more reviews that I'll be doing. I wish you guys happy hunting. And thanks for watching.